The writing was quite literally on the wall. The words above Martin Vinterkorn at the Frankfurt Auto Show last week, now all too true. Volkswagen CEO is indeed on the move. His resignation came after a grilling by the company's executive committee, after which one member, Bertolt Huber, hinted that further heads could roll. In today's meeting, we agreed that the events have to be fully investigated and that it's important that misconduct be punished. The revelation that Volkswagen rigged US emissions tests has wiped more than 30% off its market value and left its reputation in tatters not just in markets, but on petrol station forecourts too. I'm really embarrassed right now to drive a VW diesel. I wouldn't buy a VW uh, in the next year, let's say. The scandal is being seen by some as the auto industry's LIBOR moment, but Jane Thomas from Emissions Analytics thinks any consumer backlash won't last long. I think people are more concerned about how much it costs to run their car rather than what comes out of the tailpipe in terms of Um, urban air quality and air polluting gases. So I don't think it will change people's behaviour significantly. Even so, Vinterkorn's replacement will have a difficult job. One German paper is reporting it'll be Matthias Muller, the current head of VW's Porsche business. The company's already set aside 6.5 billion euros to cover the costs of the crisis, but most analysts doubt even that will be enough.